I never was a fan of Mac OS, but I couldn't resist. And this video is about eight reasons that made me to switch to MacBook. And I think that I will never come back to Windows again. You cannot find this on any Windows device where everything is packed in such a tiny small piece of hardware. It is a MacBook Pro 14 inches with an M1 Max processor. And if you have ever done the same, I think you'll understand that it is not so easy to switch to another operating system. But today's video is not about that. Today I will tell you what I like the most from a hardware perspective about my new computer. So let's start. And the first one is quality. When I unpacked this computer, I was just kind of staring, waving it around in my hands for five minutes, touching it because it is so nice. Awesome quality of premium materials. Everything is made as it should. I have XPS 9570, it is Dell. And it is also one of the most premium computers on Windows. And two years ago, I paid tons of money for it, but I didn't feel the same when I unpacked it then. Yes, it is also made quite well, but I want to admit that the MacBook Pro is made better than 9570. So the second thing that I like is instant turning on. The experience is the same as on your smartphone. You just open the screen and it'll flick immediately into life. It turns on in a half a second or maybe even less. I never experienced anything like that on any Windows PC, laptops or another Windows device. And it is a huge, unique and awesome feature thanks to the M1 ARM based SoC. And it is fantastic. Next, the battery life on this machine is also awesome. I never had such a feeling that when I take a laptop somewhere with me, I just have to check if it is charged. If it is charged, then everything is okay. It will last up to 10 hours on screen time with a comfortable brightness, depending on the tasks that I will need to do. For example, on my Dell, battery was lasting three times less. Fourth, keyboard. This keyboard is different. It's one of the most touch enjoyable keyboards that I've ever used. Typing on it is pleasurable as ever. I like the sound and the travel of the keys. It feels way better than on my Dell XPS 9570. And Apple is saying that this keyboard is with the tactile feel of mechanical keys. Um, well, it is not quite so, but as I said, feeling is really awesome. Fifth touchpad. You know, I cannot compare it with the Windows touchpads even close because this is not comparable. I cannot believe that this touchpad has no movable parts, but it feels so natural that when you press it, it feels like you pressed it, like a physical button, but it's not pressable. It has Taptic Engine inside that mimics the downward motion of a trackpad by tapping back in the opposite direction of your click. It is so cool and the gestures are very comfortable and I think I will make a separate video on that because I'm trying to get very deep into everything about this computer sound. For me it was very strange to hear such sound from a notebook. I never heard anything like that before. It has six speaker sound system and it feels like some kind of small Bluetooth speaker is integrated into this device. No. It sounds incredible. Compared to my Dell XPS, sound is much richer and has much more bass. Seventh, portability. Yes, there are a lot of powerful machines on Windows like Asus Zephyrus G15 or Lenovo Legion series. These are powerful laptops and they are bulky. And even if you can find a smaller Windows computer like a 14 inches Razer Blade, you will still get a louder computer because of fans. That will turn on more frequently and, and Razer will always need AC power for its potential to be shown. With the MacBook, you can get 100% of its power even if it's not plugged in. Shh, do you hear anything? Neither am I. Because this computer works so quietly. It has fans for emergency cases, but it is rarely using it because there is no need to if you are doing simple tasks like browsing the internet or scripting text. And even if I'm working with quite demanding DaVinci Resolve, MacBook is not using its fans. It's insane. You know, I remember my first Dell XPS 9570 unboxing and first start. It was horrible because it started to roll like a jet engine CFM56 and I was really upset when I heard that because I was doing simple tasks like browsing in Chrome. So I'm very happy with my MacBook after my Dell. Now I can work on this computer even when someone is sleeping beside me. Just think about it. There is no such computer on Windows that could work so 
quietly and this is one of the main reasons that made me to move from my Dell machine. But despite the hardware, this computer has software, the macOS, and everything is not so easy with it. In this video I had lots of trouble while using operating system that has completely different logic and it was not easy. Click here if you want to see it. Thank you and have a nice day.